Today we're going to take a look at the eighth release in the Disney Backstage Collection subscription service from Shop Disney. What's up everyone, it's Ryan from Disney Pins Blog and welcome back to another Disney Backstage Collection canister. Going to open this guy up today. It features the Emperor's New Groove and this is actually the April 2020 release. They uh, were delayed due to the pandemic. Um, shipping was delayed. I actually just got this in the mail today. It is May 12th, 2020. So because they always arrive at the end of the month. Um, so yeah, not too bad of a delay there. I'm not sure if the May one will be delayed as well. Maybe it'll come at the end of the, this month or maybe beginning of June. We'll see. But uh, yeah, here is the eighth release. And this canister is very colorful. You see different sketches and artwork of characters from the film. Up top here you can see eighth release in this series. And I did open it up already. If you guys remember last month, the uh, Star Wars Galaxy's Edge one, I have it up over here on the site. Now that I'm looking at the site, I think this is wrong actually. Unless they just forgot to send the seventh re release. But yeah, this started in October with the Disney Bros. And then, yeah, so October was Disney Bros, first one. November was Toy Story 4. December was the Three Caballeros. Uh, January was the Haunted Mansion. February was Fantasia. And last month in March was Star Wars Galaxy's Edge. That's six releases. This is the next one here, which says eighth release. So maybe they just skipped the seventh one due to the, the delay and they sent May and we didn't get April yet or they just messed up the canister and this is actually the seventh release. Not sure. I guess we'll wait and see on the next one. But yeah, let's just go ahead and open it up. If you guys remember on that last one, I was just about to say this, but uh, on the last release, the Star Wars Galaxy's Edge one, which is the sixth release last month in March 2020, um, they didn't send my pin. I opened up the canister, all it had was the shirt and the story card. Um, and then I called the customer service at uh, Shop Disney or their subscription service and they sent me a replacement pin in the mail. Very nice of them. Um, but this one I'm opening up now. I actually just opened up like a couple hours ago to look inside and make sure the pin was there. It is here. The shirt is here. And the pin. But no story card this time. Completely empty. Which I'm not going to ask them about the story card. I don't care that much. It is nice to read the whole backstory behind because the story card kind of pulls the canister and the shirt and the pin together. Um, you know, basically tells a story related to whatever it is, whether it's an attraction or a film. Um, but yeah, I don't I don't have it with this one. It wasn't in the canister. But we do have the shirt and the pin. So all I really care about is the pin. Um, the shirts are, you know, they're, they're okay. So um, yeah, let's go ahead and we'll open this up. Take a closer look at the pin. Let's just get right into the pin right now, actually. I'll leave a link below to the blog post with images of this pin and you can find all the links to the previous releases in this canister series. But yeah, this pin features Kronk from the movie as the angel. Um, so he's the angel in the center and it's almost like a sketch of him. And then the frame on the outside is him as the devil. Um, so pretty cool pin, unique. I've, I've never really seen a pin like this before. So there we go. I'll show you guys you know, a closer look at the end here, but um, just for quick reference here, you can see Kronk there in the center is the angel and then the frame, the red border going around the frame there and him as the devil um, up top. So pretty unique pin. Uh, this is exclusive to the Disney Backstage Collection subscription service from Shop Disney, the official Disney pin trading logo for 2020. Um, so yeah, you can't purchase this pin. They, you can only get them in the canister subscription service. So there we have the pin. Either the 7th or 8th release. We, we don't know. Now let's get into the shirt. I can just see here quickly it's gray in color. So we'll see what style this one is. And uh, when I opened this up here, this is the first time seeing it. I didn't see anyone else post them online. Usually I do, but uh, yeah, first time seeing it here. All right, let's see what this looks like. Okay, it's like a dark gray. Oh, wow, huge image on the back. And oh, nice, on the front you have like the embroidered uh, character here. I'll show you the back in a second, but um, there's like the left pocket side of the shirt. It's not a pocket, but the left side of the shirt. 
there's the uh, graphic there, pretty cool. And then at the bottom, it has the film logo, the Emperor's New Groove there at the bottom, like a little patch style. And on the back, check this out. Wow, that's cool. A big sketch on the back. It almost looks like it was drawn with like a, a Sharpie or a magic marker. <laughs> that's really cool how that's printed on there. There is a closer look at the back. So this is on the back of the shirt, a giant, you know, sketch style graphic. So very cool. You can be sporting this shirt, have that in the back, and then there's the front again. Hope you guys enjoyed a closer look at the Emperor's New Groove Disney Backstage Collection. Again, link is below for the blog post if you want to see a closer image of the pin. Thanks for watching, everyone. See ya. Yeah.